Okay guys, we're in uh, part two of using Scrapebox to find some really great domains uh, at Go, GoDaddy auctions and closeouts. And as I told you before, I've, I've pulled up the file that has the, uh, the domains that uh, Scrapebox scraped for me. And I'm going to copy those. I'm going to paste them into the Bulk Majestic box and I'm going to hit Check Stats. Okay guys. That took two or three minutes, and I didn't want to put you through that. But as you see, we've got a list now of all the domains. Uh, there's a lot of duds in here, but we're gonna you're gonna find there are a handful uh, that are worth some follow-up. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna download those, pull them up, highlight them all, go to data, click sort. I like to sort on Trustflow largest to smallest and as you can see we've got pickings are a little slim and and this is later in the day too a lot of the good ones I think are gone in general I, I don't start analyzing anything that's not at least a trust flow of 18 unless it's dead on balls consistent with what I want from a niche standpoint um, and in this case, you know, not none of these looks particularly great. I guess you know this one, this one isn't isn't too bad. Um, yeah, I might run this through um, Ahrefs and then move on to SERP.net to get a you know a good view of uh, of the bigger picture with this one just to see because the citation flow is pretty good. It's been my experience that. If you can start with a domain where the citation flow is a couple of times what trust flow is, you know, ballpark, give or take, uh, you could do some work with some infographics and some high quality content to begin to inch that trust flow up. That stuff will get shared. You can socially, I mean, there's just a, a ton of stuff. It's probably, it's way more than we want to do in a little video on Scrapebox, um, using Scrapebox for domains. But, there, but trust me, there's ways that you can drag trust flow up in relatively short order to get closer to citation flow. But anyway, I, sorry I did this so late at night because this is probably why the inventory of domains isn't great. You can also do this on the um, closeout. Uh, you know, the closeout domains uh, run the list. Generally, what you do is you get more than the 3,000 that Todd's uh, bulk majestic, majestic scraper allows at one time. So what you've got to do is um, you know cut and paste and do a couple of different spreadsheets to get at the the cream but you know you can sometimes it shocks me what you can find for eight or nine bucks and every once in a while even even five dollars uh, you know definitely worth buying these things are already indexed um, there's very little work to do to make them uh, start going higher so anyway it's doc i'll talk to you